I was abused by my ex-husband, and I have post-traumatic stress disorder. Uh, it's not great. I look so normal. That's why it's called the invisible disability. I, I worked full-time for the phone company in Wisconsin and uh, really enjoyed the heck out of it, made good money. And uh, there came a point where I just couldn't do it anymore. I just couldn't. I couldn't take a step. I just had to lock myself in the house and not leave. I'm just one person, but I represent thousands of people right here in the Nebraska. I represent the disabled. My car battery went dead, and I had to go get another one, and I wasn't expecting that $100 expense. And, and it wrecked me. It seems minuscule that a hundred, little over a hundred dollars can make a big difference. But when you're living on the edge, it makes a huge difference. I have friends who will help me, but you know, I should be able to do it. I'm not lazy. I'm not. I don't. I don't. I'd work if I could. I loved working, but I can't. It's as simple as that. There are plenty of people in my situation. Uh, and it just doesn't make any sense.